Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of my survival world. And Whoa. That was weird on my end. Probably didn't look like anything on yours, but it's just how it goes. But I forgot to show you that that little stair is a skelly farm. Basic drowning design. And this is a top view of my place, and I want to thinking about building my portal to the Nether up here. I'm back on hard. The skelly just died right there. <laughs> so maybe, actually, if this is one, then mm. it this might be kind of cool. <laughs> Eh, it will be hard to make a pathway up to there, so. As of right now, it's kind of a hard a parkour challenge getting up here. And I made myself some armor. So I don't just like die when I instantly join. So that'll be bad. Put that away. Get the bow and the sword in the right spots. I haven't made an enchanting table yet. Um, I should, but I don't have an experience farm, which is why I'm going to the Nether. It might sound, sound kind of weird. Woke up just a little while ago. Wait, what? No way. I'm far too far away from this portal. This is my 1.7 portal. What's going on? So now I might respawn in the volcano. Yep. Dang it. How is like 600 blocks away not far enough for another portal? Ah, that bugs me. That really, really bugs me. Man. Now I have a weird clash of portals going on. I don't like it. At all. <sighs> Man. All right. Well, I guess it's about time to uh, start that little chest area. So I'm gonna come up here, make myself all those chests, and get to work. All right, so I found this island. <clears throat> that way is on 1.7 area. This way is on 1.8. And I think it's pretty good. I'm not sure it's big enough. But, hmm. Yeah, maybe I should move a little bit more close to 1.8. But, I'm thinking it's sort of a locker room type thing. Where... It's set up. Hey, sheep. I'm going to need you later. Whoa. Did you see that weird? Ah, I was... Never seen that before. Hmm. Yeah, this island looks much better. 
for what I want. So, rip down some trees, get them out of my way. And I could either go for a really dark bunker look, uh, army bunker type thing, or a normal, um, I don't, I'm not sure how to make this look, but as far as a chest goes, I'm thinking something like this. Get these out of the way. Two chests. Something like that. And then... I need a crafting table. Who knows what number of crafting table this is on my world. That's not a crafting table. Give me that back. But, make some stairs. And then alternate them. Like that. And then you put another double chest on top. Alternate them. Like that. Another one. And then that's that's one chest area. For plain wood. Like this. And then, like, another one would be over here for cow. Cow. I need to clear out the dirt anyways. So hopefully you move by then. Nope. I don't have any wheat to lead. Oh, I do have. Come here. Get away from there. Okay. That's good enough. It's another one like that. Of course there'll be something other than grass as a flooring. But a design like this, I'm thinking. And this will be for wooden planks and half slabs and stuff like that. And then, more stairs come above it, if I could get up there, show you. Um, this is going the opposite way, this is going this way, and then these two go like this. And they're lockers. It looks way better if they're one wide chests. But then, based on all the tools I need, uh, all the tools I have, I'm going to need a very tall room. <laughs> um, and behind it will be more. In a style like this, let's do not dirt, so go to grass, cobble, and then put the chest down. I can't, ah, oh, that's right, but I can put them down right here. So the cobble, and then the stairs. They come like this. Oh. Sorry, they come like this. Not like that. Place them down. And then, and then we, there we go. They alternate like that. Oh, I don't have any torches. Dang it. Let's light it up. Let's 
Let's make sure it's not near anything that could burn. That looks dangerous. <laughs> um, down here. If it burns, no worries. I have to rip it down. Look at that gravel beach. One point seven lands. If you haven't played it in one point seven, I'm sorry, but you missed out on some pretty cool beta updates. Hello. Scully's already appearing. And then the alternating pattern like that. I think that'll look really cool. Fits fairly thin. And like the other chests would be two blocks apart. No, that's a bit too close. Three blocks. Yeah, that looks, that looks much better. And then, like, the other rows are down here. And it looks like that, yeah. So, give me some more time to uh, survive, and then keep working. All right. I'm back, and I'm going to try out my portal things again. This is how I farm obsidian. Redstone next to flowing water. Pour lava on top, and you get obsidian. It's a bit testy like that sometimes. It just doesn't want to move further than that, even though it says it should. And it does. But occasionally it does that weird... I'm going to stop right there, thing. There we go. Obsidian. And I did that for a bit. And that plus farming that gives 34 obsidian. So I'm going to try it deep down in my mines. Further away from 1.7 lands. Which is another plus. So let's go down here. Do you have a minecart? Should ride that trail if we can. I don't know. Never mind. I think the minecart's actually at the bottom. So it always did that to me. So we'll just go down this weirdly torched path. At least you don't have to jump up it. Oof, there it is. Evil cart. Okay, so my strip mine is this way and then down and then backwards just a little. It's inside a ravine. Here we go. Never cleared out this ravine. Just focus on the strip mining instead. Ton of iron everywhere. Ton of dark spots everywhere. Here we go. Ravine chest. And my strip mine is right down here. So, <clears throat> I believe that's end of the tour, officially. Even though it's end of the tour officially last episode but time to get this portal situated and I don't want to build it over there let's build it over here instead nope Okay, so we 
we're at. Okay, so that's my way out. So let's just go right over here. These six spots are the portal spaces. We can actually save some since we can't even see the corners. We could save some obsidian. Alright, let's put that away because it takes forever to break if I accidentally place it. And let's hope for some luck. Bow out would probably be the best. Dang it! Alright, time to uh, run all the way back again. Yay, I figured out the problem. Well, no, I didn't figure out the problem at all, but I've got a solution. Okay, so what I did was go to the nether portal at my 1.7 base. And so I was in the nether. I destroyed that portal in the nether. Dumped everything in a chest and killed myself. Respawned in my bed in this area, 1.8. Came down through this portal. And it popped me out somewhere different because there's no portal in the nether yet. I got a new nether portal down here. It's way down, level 35. And then I ran back up. Oh, I can't run anymore. But yeah, go around this lava fall because there's no way to jump over it, especially without sprint. But Come this way. They're not very far apart at all. Um, come this way. There's a gravel pillar right there. And that's where you go up. Temporarily. That's where you go up. And I'm not sure I can make it because one of the gravel I got turned into flint coming back down. To steal a soul sand. And sack with it first. <laughs> okay, so go up this way. Ooh, bit of lag there. Ah. Stop. Stop. Okay, so you come out this, this way. Then there's actually a staircase right here from when I actually was doing stuff in the nether. And you come out these little pillar markings. And the portal itself is through these torches, and right there is the bunker. So, yep. So I have to think of a way to connect these two portals in an easier fashion. Let me get all my stuff. <laughs> oh, I uh, dumped my arrows in the other chest, but if you go through this portal, which I reactivated, put the obsidian block down, relit it, and it actually goes back right to my volcano. Bam. Volcano. Yay. So I got it all figured out, finally. Now it's just time to find another stronghold and get 
get my bases connected down there. I like to use stone picks in the nether because nether brick breaks so fast anyways. But let's go through again. Leave my diamond stuff there. Craft these stone tools. And time to work on connecting my areas. Alright, welcome back. I'm down at my... I need names for these things. My sign fields portal in the nether. And I finished the path. Complete with stairs for a walkway and room for rails in the future. And a bit, some walls to stop all the gas. So many. Ah. But. Might as well walk up and show you what's going on. A little bit of diagonal there. I messed up at the top of these stairs. Because I was originally. It was originally one wide, so I could just go straight up and up, but with two wide, it came came kind of confusing, so I had to do this little twisty thing, and I need to make room for rails to actually work, to align themselves properly. So yeah, kind of weird, but it'll work, and it's not that bad at all. So I'm on top of the nether. And there's already another gas. <clears throat> Still no gas tears. Come on, gas tier. Yes, my first gas tier on camera. Oh yeah. Instant health potions. Yep. I don't really need them, but especially for this this world. But here we go. End of the tunnel. Type kind of a tunnel. Semi tunnel. And go back down, which is much faster because you don't have to climb upstairs. But I just want to top off my little base down here. I'm not very creative in the nether. Because it's not a very creative place to be. But I did think of a little something to do. And I used the rest of my stairs on my roof for this bunker. And created a little outpost and eventually these walls will include some glass to see what's going on super pigmen look at all these mushrooms 1.7 mushroom spread for the win but there we go I think it looks really really cool with the stairs and the corners like that much better looking bunker Maybe a few out of place netherrack like that. And maybe right, right here. Just to get in and to replace it. But there we go. Do the same on this side. And bam. Alright. So it works. <laughs> and we are beneath the sun fields. Alright. So, got the nether portals all situated. I'll figure it out. Fairly cool. Workbenches everywhere. And this is Dungan. Hope you enjoyed this episode. See ya.